Hi guys, what is up and welcome back for another mob battle on the channel. I know it's been a fair few weeks, but you know, missing out on videos and whatnot, but we are going to try and get back into the swing of things. Uh, so I do apologise for that, there has been reasons, but you know, won't discuss them on here, nobody needs to know. But anyway, let's get on with a mob battle today. It is going to be beautiful, we are back, it's going to be epic. So today we are going to be looking at the Warped Moscow going up against the Ice and Fire mods. Now, these are... I love the Warped Moscow. If you saw my review on the part 2 of Alex's Mobs Mob update, it's such a cool mob. And the drops from this and the gun you can make from it, it's epic. You, you have to check it out. It's a must. It, just download Alex's Mobs, guys. It's such a sick mod. And... You know, Ice and Fire, such a big mod on the channel. Uh, such a big mod in general, everyone loves it. But, guys, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, notification bell, like button, all that good stuff. Alright, let's crack on with it. I don't want to waste any more time, I'm excited. It's good to be back. Alright, let's check, pop that on hard. Are we ready to rumble? Now, the Warped Moscow, I don't think I will need a mob battle stick for, but I've got one just in case. It tends to attack anything in the surrounding area. So, we're going to go for a Dreadlich first, and now we're going to go for the Warped Moscow. And it has already begun. The Warped Moscow has 100 HP, but it has regen, because when it takes the health of another mob, it regens itself. And I feel like it's already done it. Is it going to lose to this guy? No, not in the slightest. Wow, this guy worked quick. He is a bit of a beast. And uh, as you saw, like he doesn't actually have that much health, but he is strong and he has a bit of regen. So it's going to help him out tremendously. Now, let's go on with the Mo Warped Moscow versus a Mimics Royal. Now, two flying mobs, so let's see how this goes. Are they near each other? Go for him, bro. Do it. Uh, I don't want to use the mob battle stick. Oh, I don't really mind. Alrighty, uh, so they both have... Okay, there you go. The Warped Moscow is very quick. And as you can see, it's doing 8, 9 HP worth of damage per hit. Well, what is... Okay, wow. So... <sighs> The, the Mimics Royal, I think, was it was doing a fair bit as well. It was doing a fair bit as well, but nowhere near what the Warped Moscow was packing. Wowzers. Okay. Warped Moscow is powering through these, but I don't think it's going to survive our next few mobs. I don't. I really don't. So I think we're going to have to spawn in a few Warped Moscows, in fact, to survive these. But... That's what we're here to find out. Let's do it. We have a Cyclops versus a Warped Moscow. And the Warped Moscow actually seems to be sort of fleeing in fear. Oh, no, no, there, there he goes. And so, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Did the Warped Moscow just pull a Cyclops on the Cyclops? Normally, the Cyclops is the one that picks up the mobs and eats them. Now, this is a change of events, and I, I, I want to see where this comes down to, because this is ridiculous. The Warped Moscow is regening like crazy from this, and it seems to be doing phenomenally well and now is using some ranged attacks and regening at the same flipping time what <laughs> i'm sorry did this just happen did the i'm 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 sorry did the warped moscow just destroy the cyclops seriously oh wow wowzers Okay, that has taken me and I'm sure everybody by surprise. Nobody really anticipated that one. I definitely didn't. Uh, so let's get rid of this guy and let's spawn in a new one. And we're going to have uh, a lightning dragon up next. And I'll tell you what, if he does well against some of these, we're going to get the hydra up in here. I might just get the hydra up in here anyway and substitute one of these guys out for a hydra because I think that would be sick. Okay, 
So let's go and spawn in a lightning dragon first. And what one? Do okay, you know what? That's that's strong enough. That's strong enough for the walk to Moscow. Okay, go for him, bro. Uh, is he gonna go for him? No, we are. I'm glad I got the mob battle stick out. That is gonna be good. Okay, there we go. Okay, so the lightning dragon is going at him now, but the warp to Moscow is very powerful, it turns out. And is it able to do any of its, like, leeching abilities? No, it's gone for the aerial assault. The, the lightning dragon is having a nightmare. Now, I know everyone's like, oh, but the lightning dragon isn't in his element. Now he is. There is no excuse anymore. These are both flying mobs. They know what's up. Okay, the lightning dragon is going for this guy. I don't 100% know. Is the, warped, the warped Moscow is sniping through the arena. The lightning dragon is having a nightmare. And it looks like the lightning dragon might actually die. They are both on very similar amounts of health. Where did the warped Moscow go? Tell me he's, he's there. He's good. He's chilling. He's grilling. And it actually has more health now than before. Okay, I do, is he up here now? I, I'm trying to find the warped Moscow, uh, but he keeps sort of disappearing off. Uh, did he die? Did anybody see the death of the warped Moscow? Because I certainly didn't. Uh... I'm, I'm now just purely looking for him, to be honest. I uh, don't know where he went. Did the lightning... Nope, there he is. He's killing cows. He's re... He's... <laughs> I don't know what he's doing. This is not the battle we put you in. Okay? So, let's, let's start that again. Uh, let's go over here and get the lightning dragon. Okay, they are both vexed and angry now. The warp to Moscow is strutting over, I think. Uh, flying over. There we go. And it is back on. Booyah! Okay, so Warped Moscow, not sure what happened there. Oh my goodness. And I think he's dead. And it, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, he did. Lightning Dragon got him. Wow, that was a close one though. The Lightning Dragon had over double the health of the Warped Moscow. And just from the pure fact the Warped Moscow lasted that long is insane to me. Uh, and we're definitely going to spawn in loads at the end. I don't think there's going to be overly a massive amount of difference going between the... Di I'll tell you what, we'll, we'll do the Ice Dragon and Watch Moscow. We won't we won't worry overly about the fire. Uh, I'll tell you what, we're going to feed you this, and then we're going to feed you this. And we're going to make you... Yeah, that should be a good amount. That is double the Walked Moscow, so it should be, you know, fair. Okay, go for it, guys. Oh, the Walked Moscow fears no cold, even though it's from the Never. Technically, it, the cold really should probably bother it, but it doesn't seem to be at all, even though it is now frozen in blocks of ice. It actually seems the Ice Dragon is doing a lot better than the fire, the, the Lightning Dragon. Yep, the Walked Moscow is probably going to die a lot quicker than the Lightning Dragon did, unless the Walked Moscow is going to regen a load of health very quickly. Oh, it's, it's close. It is a close battle. If it wasn't for that Ice Cube at the start of this, the, ice dra uh, the Walked Moscow would have had this battle in the bag, but it's actually looking like the Walked Moscow... No, it's not going to happen. It's very close. And it <laughs> the Walked Moscow has somehow beaten the ice dragon i don't even know i'm i'm baffled by that that is ridiculous the, this warped moscow is so powerful for what it is imagine trying to fight this guy in a survival scenario he is just crazy powerful he's fast quick same sort of thing don't know why i said it twice you know what he's so quick and so fast that it needed to be emphasized and strong and has mad defense on him as well all right you know what while, while we're here we're gonna do the fire dragon it has to be done it needed to be done let's do it let's get this guy up to where should we put him to uh, but that will do that should that's a good amount Walk to Moscow, get in here, bro. Fight this guy. No, don't don't stand on the ice. That is not what we want. Okay. 
this this is going to be interesting. Now, can the Warped Moss go take out all these different types of mobs? I really hope so. And it seems like there's a little lag or something going on. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, Warped Moscow is very injured. The Fire Dragon is obviously just chilling in his fire. The Warped Moscow's attacks are pretty much doing nothing to this guy. And the Warped Moscow is only burning when it goes close to him. So the Fire Dragon seems to be an absolute nightmare for this guy. Which I'm quite baffled by, considering the Warped Moscow comes from an environment of lava and fire. So explain that one to me. The Fire Dragon is not fussed by this guy at all. So I'm going to see if I can just... No, stay there, stay there. Uh, okay, wow, well, okay, the Fire Dragon killed him. I'm going to give that to the Fire Dragon. Fair play, broski. Alright, but you know what? We all want to see what the Hydra is like. and I'm, I'm not going to hold you back from that. We all want to see it. I want to see it. The Hydra's going to be sick against this. I think the Hydra's going to win because the Hydra tends to always win unless it's against something that shoots fire. But I don't know if the War Moscow's like range attack will be classed as almost like a fire aspect against the Hydra. Now that would be interesting. But these poison gas clouds are going to cause a lot of damage for the Warped Moscow. And as you can see, the... The Hydra heads are going in on it. Okay, so the Warped Moscow has taken out one head, but it needs its ranged attack. Okay, it is draining the Hydra of its health, which is working, which is working very well. And it's, it's, it's a battle of who can regen faster at this point. The Hydra is trying to regen as fast as it can, but the Warped Moscow is having absolutely none of it. The Hydra is piling on that health. Look at that, the Warped Moscow really needed to keep up that close quarter combat with this guy. This, the range attacks are just not working because the Hydra can regen faster. It's when the Warped Moscow did the blood sucking abilities on the Hydra. That is when it was it looking good for the Warped Moscow. But it's looking less promising now and it is over. But my word, the Warped Moscow took this guy down so much all of this guy's nine heads have appeared and i think that's the quickest any mob has made the nine heads of the hydra appear like that that is crazy just that is just credit to the warped moscow in itself for being such a phenomenal mob you guys if you haven't checked it out as i was saying earlier go check out alex's mobs mod because it is absolutely outstanding but anyway guys thank you so much for watching and sticking with the channel as usual. Until next time, see ya.